everybody. Good morning. Um, it's just me right now. I'm actually sitting outside um, having some breakfast. I got, actually got these. Um, these are gluten-free Simba waffles. Um, they're okay. I already took a big bite. They're okay. Not like my favorite thing. I don't feel the need to order them again, but I'm, I'm glad I did. I wanted to try these. It's the first time I've tried the gluten-free waffles here. So not too bad. Just dip them in some syrup and, you know, they taste pretty good. I actually ended up getting just a, a kid's meal. Um, it was a, just a waffle and a yogurt, but it was like $6, so that's not too bad. And I, I am, I'm glad I tried it. Um, like I said, I probably don't, I won't get that again, but, you know, for gluten-free, actually really, really good. Um, but yeah, I'm just having a slow morning. Jeremy's back at the room. He's not a big breakfast person, and we were out late last night, so he's kind of slept in this morning. Um, just relaxing and lounging. We're heading over to Epcot in a little while, and we'll see what our day takes us. But yeah, having a great time. And I'll talk to you guys later. Ciao, bonjour, and bienvenue. Hello, and welcome to Disney's Riviera Resort. If you are traveling to Epcot, please remain on board. All right, guys. So one of the cool things about Epcot right now is they're having the Food and Wine Festival. And so I just stopped over on the Australia booth. This is a lamb chop and, I don't know, some green things and veggies. And then for dessert, I got this really cool um, yeah. pavlova, it's called. And it's all gluten-free, so I'm really excited to try that. I grabbed two spoons so Jeremy could have a taste. So anyway, this is a lamb chop. I actually really like lamb chop. I don't think I'm going to be able to use the fork, though. All right, so I'm going to try. It's so tender. Oh, my gosh. Wow, that's so, so good. Mmm, I really like that. Yep, I like it. Mm. Alright, so now I'm going to try the dessert. Um, it's kind of like a berries with some cream, whipped cream here. It actually looks really good. Now, as far as like food in my festival, I mean, they have great food all around the place. It's, well, first of all, it's hard to find something gluten free. Not hard, it's just, it's a little bit more challenging. And also, I'm not a huge eater. Like, what I just ate, I'm probably gonna hold me over until dinner time. Yeah, until dinner time. So, um, I'm probably not gonna do a whole lot of this, but I just wanna try a couple little things anyway. And that really caught my eye. So, I'm gonna try this. So I'm gonna try it with a raspberry. This raspberry looks really good. And this looks really. What is this? Oh, this looks kind of like hard. All right, I'll try that after. I'm gonna try it with a raspberry. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wow. That's fantastic. I really like that. Yeah, that is really good. Mm. I'm not sure what this thing is. It's hard. Maybe like meringue? It's probably meringue. Oh, all right. Okay, well, I'm gonna try it, but yeah, it's, it looks really good. I have to like cut it up and stuff. Take a bite out of it. Well, I have to pick it up. All right. All right, here we go. Mm. Oh, yeah, it's a meringue. Mm hmm. Oh, weird. Good though. Yeah, that's good. Okay, guys, we're going on our first ride of the day. Uh, by the way, that dessert I just had was so, so good. Anyway, this is one of Jaden's favorite, well, it used to be one of Jaden's favorite rides. It's the Figment. Uh, Journey into Imagination with Figment. Uh, Jaden, when he was little, used to love Figment. It was his favorite. Not so much anymore as he's gotten older, but that's okay. You know, you all grow things. Um, but I'm going to ride it because it's a super fun ride, so, yeah. Sound. <laughs> Smell. Playing with your imagination. Now I answer your name, but please read line three. <laughs> with Bell by GFGMT, you can see things differently. <laughs> sure, you can see with your eyes, but imagine what you could see if you used your imagination. This is not a good time. Mm.
<laughs> now we're going on the Nemo ride. I love the seagulls. Where are they? Over here. Bye, bye, bye. I love, this. I love this shot right here. You can see the seas and you can see the ball over there. It's pretty. On the way! Nemo! Let's go explore, explore, explore. Let's go explore the big blue world. Hey, Mr. Ray, we can't explore without Nemo. I'm sure we'll... Hi, I'm Dory. So after the ride, you come out and it's just like these big, huge aquariums that the twins just sit here for hours just looking at all the fish. They absolutely loved it here. Okay guys, this is a really, really cool place. Um, That's like one of my favorite places. This is called the Land Pavilion. And you've got Soren over there. I know, it's backwards. You've got Living with the Land over there. Um, it's, it's really nice. It's always a nice break to come in here. Plenty of seating. Um, and it's got two really cool rides. So yeah, I really like it in here. It's like one of my, one of my favorite places to just come and chill out. So I'm just gonna, Walk around. We're gonna probably ride on Soren, which is like one of my favorite rides. Although I'll tell you what, Flight of Passage kind of makes Soren look like you know uh, old school, <laughs> but it's still fun. I still like to do it. So this ride's kind of neat. So these are like um, like a ski lift type of thing. So yeah. This is really kind of cool. It's like a ski lift and what's going to happen is we're going to go up in the air and then that screen is going to turn into soaring around the world. Check. So. Please go all carry on. Jeremy, they're pretty good, right? They're great. Yeah. He's dying. Look, I just turned the phone on to vlog and I already said the device is too hot. This is why I'm not really vlogging a whole lot, especially the outside. It's like 106 degrees out. Well, the feels like it. It's, it's 90 something, but the feels is like 140. Which it feels like anyway. So yeah, it's like as soon as I turn on the, the camera to vlog, it just gives me a signal. So I don't even know if this video is even going to come out. So... If it did. Hi guys. It's been great. Uh, we're having a great time. Uh, we're having fun, right? Yeah. Yeah, we're having fun. If you like sweating here, you know what's off. Anyway, talk to you guys a little bit later. Okay guys, so as you guys know, I usually like to come to Disney, but when I can't go to Disney, one of my favorite things to do is watch Disney live streamers. Well, I have a couple of my favorites, but there's a few that really, really bring Disney to your home when you can't be there. And so some of my favorite ones are standing right here. 
This is living in living in Diz. You got Corey, Corey Jillian, Jillian Tammy. Tammy, and Jacob. The boy. <laughs> the boy. Yes, that's what we used to call him. Yeah. Anyway, um, so yeah, we ran into them here. Just randomly ran into you guys. Just randomly? Oh How about that, right? That's crazy. But anyway, yeah, their channel is Living With Diz. Some of the best Disney live streamers. They really know how to bring it, you know, Disney into your home. I actually enjoy watching you guys before I go to bed at night when you're walking through Epcot and it's nice and empty and quiet. It's the best. Oh, it's like, okay, now I can go to bed. Yeah. Corey, Corey has signed up for the night. I'm going to bed. That's awesome. I love <laughs> so, that. Yeah. So this is them. So living in Diz, make sure you guys subscribe if you want to see a, a Disney live stream. These guys are here all the time. Definitely go and check them out. <laughs> Again, I don't know, man. I'm talking to a turtle. <laughs> Humans, if you want to see me swim, say go crush. I want to dedicate this one to my new friend, who totally has the awesome shawl. Rip it, roll it, and punch it, dudes. Here we go. Check it out, man. I'm totally... <laughs> hey, Crush, watch out for the glass. Oh, dude, thanks, Hank. You sound like whales. That was really amazing, everybody. I even heard some orca accents. That's super advanced. Most advanced, humans. Most advanced. Oh, you call a real whale. What? You call video clips of the crush and I think it was Dory. Yeah, Dory. Um, so that was called Turtle Talk with Crush. And they actually just brought that show back. So that was kind of cool to be able to see that. Um, hadn't seen that in years. So yeah, it was it was really it was really cute. I really like that. Oh, what's he doing? He's got hi honey. He's got a dozen cotton candy. Yeah, um, that was a really, that's a really cute show. It's very interactive. I don't know, how do they make the turtle talk to you? I have no idea how they do that. Because you can actually, hey, you can actually talk to the turtle and it talks back to you. I don't know how they do that. No idea. So guys, we're actually back in the land. Um, we were here a little bit early, we rode on Sarn, but we're actually waiting for reservations to go into, it's called the Garden Grill. What's really cool about it, first of all, there's characters, which is really awesome. There's Pluto, there's Mickey, and the running front rotates while you're eating. You can't really feel it, and it's going to go around in a circle. So I'm excited. I've always wanted to eat there, and I never have, so this should be fun. Chippendale, too. Oh, Chippendale, too? Yep. Yeah. That's Tammy. She's from uh, Living in Diz. Uh, we're still hanging out with them. So we'll see what happens. Um, hopefully they'll call us any minute. It's been a while, right? Yeah. So check this out, guys. He's slowly rotating. We're actually moving. It moves about as fast as my scooter. <laughs> In the rain. <laughs> In the rain. Going up so look at this. It's actually like, look at, it's a hidden Mickey. Yeah. Good. Right? So we got Jeremy there. We got Good, Jillian. How are you? Corey, Jacob, Tammy. <laughs> Alright guys, so check this out. I get my own nice warm buns. I think I had some like this the other day at Crystal Palace. Got some salad. Um, we got drinks here. It comes in little mason jars. How adorable. Um, and then we have the regular buns, which are actually like, really, really good. Uh, Jillian's taking a picture of those. Jimmy cherry sauce. Wow. Macaroni and cheese and some cranberry dressing as well. Very good. Okay. For you, my dear, you have the corn succotash, the green beans, you have that uh, rice pilaf, you also have 
Uh, beef and plain turkey. Okay. I brought you some other stuff. Refugee mac and ma uh, mashed potatoes. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Yes. A little bit more beef because I had said that wasn't enough. Okay. <laughs> Boy, do you take one of Good call. Of this? Yes. I don't um, know if I can get it. Guys, look at this. If there's anything that you want another portion of, please don't hesitate to ask ever anymore. Chip. On the flip side of that, chip. if there's anything left on the table, we feed it to animals or we make bus fuel with it. So you don't have to roll on it for later if you don't want to. Alright, so as you guys can see, I have my own meat, potatoes, I don't know what that is. Cranberry sauce. Yeah. Here's the green beans. And then potatoes. I got all this got stuff here. Beef, I've got uh, this here. And this Jeremy. He's like, oh yeah, get me some food. I'm going to have to do that too. Hi, your pal. Hi. 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 I know this is kind of weird. They're like popping up behind my head. It's what's so up, strange. It used to be a character meet and greet, but because of what's going on, the characters don't come over to your table anymore. They just kind of pop up behind you. It's so weird. All right, that was cute. No cheating, Jim. <laughs> he said it's over there. <laughs> All right, guys, so this is my special dessert, which I'm excited about. Look at this. This is their dessert, which looks really good. And here's mine, which doesn't look too bad now. Sometimes no whipped cream, no. Sometimes looks can be deceiving though, so I'm gonna give it a try and we'll see how it is. There's Chip. Chip. Watch that What If series. Yeah. Corey, say hi to Chip. It just keeps coming around and around. It's really fun. Chip. 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 So guys, because it rained and then we had the fireworks, it's so creepy. There's Jill, she's running around. Look at this, it's like haunted Epcot at night. I'm so used to this. This is, right? this is literally my thing, you know? I walk through the World Showcase and nobody else is here, you know? So I you are it. so lucky. I love you it so much. You are so lucky, yeah. There's a lot of the time where it's literally just me, nobody else. Just that is amazing. You're like living so many people's dreams, so. Yeah, I, I'm very, very grateful. Yeah. That's, that's like the least I can say, but I'm very, very grateful. Yes, yes. Yeah, and you can tell. You can tell. You're a good kid. But yeah, this looks really cool, guys. I am absolutely loving this. We always watch Corey um, doing these streams at night. He walks through World Showcase when it's empty. And I'm always like, I want to do that so bad. So here I am, like fulfilling one of my one of my bucket list dreams. So this is it. Guys, this is amazing. There is nobody here. A few people up, up front there, but look at this, guys. How incredible is this? Look at this, guys. This is so beautiful. So we're in France right now. That's the French restaurant. And this is the fountain. Look at that fountain. Holy guacamole. This is the Tower. This is just amazing. 